Tampa police tell us a Jacksonville rapper was shot and killed at a Holiday Inn Sunday morning. Police are still looking for the person who shot and killed a rapper and hurt three others outside of a hotel there. He goes by Julio Julio. On a fateful night in Tampa, the life of a rising rap star was cut tragically short. Fulio, the rapper known for his gritty lyrics and tumultuous lifestyle, met a violent end on what was supposed to be a joyous occasion, his 26th birthday. This is the story of Fulio, a man whose life was as explosive as his music and whose death shocked the hip hop community. Charles Jones, better known as Fulio, grew up in the challenging neighborhoods of Jacksonville, Florida. From a young age, he was surrounded by violence and hardship, experiences that would later shape his music and public persona. Despite the odds, Fulio's talent for rap and his relentless drive saw him rise through the ranks of the underground rap scene. His songs, marked by raw emotion and real life stories, resonated with many, bringing him both fame and infamy. Fulio's career was not without controversy. Known for his involvement in gang culture, his music often mirrored the violence of his surroundings. One of his most infamous tracks, When I See You, was a chilling diss track that referenced real-life incidents of violence. This song, among others, brought him into direct conflict with rival rappers and gangs, further entrenching him in the dangerous life he rapped about. Fulio's journey was marked by both talent and turbulence. His life was intricately woven with the chaotic threads of gang affiliations that shadowed his every move. Where is Corbin Johnson? The 18-year-old's parents say they dropped him off last week at a job interview and they never saw him again. Corbin got connected, lost, got his ass found. Okay. Corbin Johnson was last seen alive in July of last year. Then last Friday, a man discovered the, the victim's skeletal remains. Fulio was a member of the Jacksonville gang KTA, which had a long-standing feud with the rival gang ATK. ATK, led by prominent Jacksonville rapper Youngeen Ace, real name Kenyatta Bullard, was entangled in a deadly conflict with KTA. In November 2021, Fulio made headlines again after being grazed by a shooter's bullet while at a recording studio in Jacksonville's Riverside area. In typical Fulio fashion, he took to Instagram to taunt his assailants, saying, y'all miss a whole hundred shots, literally. The feud took a dark turn in June 2018. Fulio's cousin, Zion Brown, was killed. Make an arrest in a shooting that killed an 18-year-old and injured a teenager and a nine-year-old girl. This happened on the west side at this house on Saturday. The teenager tells News for Jax that her family was woken up about 1.30 in the morning Saturday. 18-year-old Zion Brown was the only adult in the home, along with two teens, a nine-year-old and a six-year-old boy. Today, police said DeAndre Thomas was the shooter. They charged him with murder. Which led to a retaliatory shooting aimed at Youngeen Ace. On that fateful day, Bullard and three other teens were at a town center restaurant celebrating a birthday. Bullard survived being shot eight times, but tragically, his brother Trayvon Bullard, Royal Devon Smith Jr., and Jerkaby Deshad Groover lost their lives. Following the shooting, Fulio's reaction was chilling. <laughs> Boy lost the Fortnite man. <laughs> he glorified the killings on social media and even created a t-shirt airbrushed with a photo of Royal Devon Smith Jr., mocking his death. His Instagram post proudly displayed the shirt with the caption, I'm getting a new t-shirt made for my show. These actions not only escalated the feud, but also painted a target on Fulio's back, setting the stage for the tragic end that awaited him. On June 23, 2024, Fulio was in Tampa celebrating his birthday. After a pool party at an Airbnb, Fulio and his friends were asked to leave due to occupancy issues. They moved the celebration to a Holiday Inn, but the night took a dark turn. In the early hours of the morning, Fulio was ambushed in the hotel parking lot. The ensuing gunfire left four people injured and Fulio dead. The police are still investigating the motive behind this brutal attack, but it is suspected to be gang-related. Fulio's death is a stark reminder of the violent world that often surrounds the rap industry. Despite his controversial life, 
Fulio's music spoke to many about the harsh realities of street life. His legacy is a mix of his undeniable talent and the violent circumstances that eventually led to his demise. As the hip-hop community mourns his loss, Fulio's story remains a cautionary tale of ambition, talent, and the dangers that can come with fame. Fulio's story is far from unique, but it is a powerful example of how art and life can tragically intertwine. As we remember him through his music, we are reminded of the stark realities that many face and the enduring impact that one person's story can have on the world.